Hello and welcome to my video on Waspit. Uh, this is Eli J. Brown Special Link and Roto Fan. I forgot to say that before. I usually say it before I say the item I'm reviewing. But here is Waspit. Waspit is a uh, wasp leg creature. I actually have wasp phobia. Don't try to tease me on that. But, you should know why I have Waspphobia. They have stingers, but Waspix is alright. Uh, for a set. Surprisingly. Waspix didn't even sting any of the heroes in the movie. So. Same body armor there. It doesn't appear to be any extra small parts. These are the Ben 10 claws that I never got my hand on until now. Still a few parts in there. They look fairly easy, actually. Oh, here's an interesting piece here. That's pretty new for the Hero Factory set series. I don't know if it was in any other LEGO set before. I think there were any. Waspic has the Shadow Maturian feet too. Gotta be careful not to break them. Unless they are more dura durable than the old one, although I don't think they are. But maybe they are, I don't really know. Plastic is very tall with these uh, leg joints. And here are some other parts that we've seen before. Uh, Evo. This is also seen before on Evo. This is. Plastic actually has. Three stingers. One is on the tail, and the other two are on uh, a couple of the arms. Uh, it's there. Third point. These are very uh, flexible. I didn't expect them to be this flexible. But this is uh, the first official Hero Factory set to include these. They were available on Pick a Brick and also on Hero Recon Team, although I never purchased a hero that had one of these. I don't even care to, about doing so. But I got them right here. Here. Oh. And then more of these hands. Why couldn't Lego just have the instructions tell us to do all four at once rather than just two at a time? At least I think there are just four. Yeah, there are just four. I just looked at the box. And the unique armor piece, forgot to mention that for Raja and Fang. I get those reviews. That's one of the singers. One of the other singers, I already mentioned the first one. And the third singer. Here are the wings. Nice. Yeah. What number are these? It's been great. On right here, the corrupted quasi spikes. The 
armor plate piece up. And this armor piece here, this is the first time it is shown in yellow. I mean, uh, it was in the yellow-orange on Jetbug and Strainer 3.0, but this is the first time it's in this shade of yellow. Now, there's the head. Here's the Wattpix head. Although it's the same one on Scorpio, just in a different color. They turned the last page sideways. I guess Wattpix was just too tall. Fit in the normal way, and we have four extra spikes. But it, but the instructions say there are only two. Oh well, I guess it's the same dilemma as uh, my Breeze 1.0, including three armor pieces. So this is Wasp. She is a Wasp type creature, and yeah, that's right, I said she, the Wastix we saw in the movie, was female, although there are possibly the male Wastix as well, but I'm gonna call this one a she, referring, referring it as the one we saw in the movie. Uh, she's got uh, two Wastix spikes on her wing, controlled by Witch Doctor. and she has her own intelligence again. I'm free! Yep, she is free. That, and when, if I do a Hero Factory set remake, I'll put the spike back on, but then take it back off as soon as I'm done making the video. So, that is my review on Watch This, then. Watch This is one heck of a set. We'll find her in uh, the Hero Factory parodies in the future. And that is going to be all for this video.